Hi everyone, uh, today I'm gonna show you how to uh, make your uh, Hitman Absolution not crashing or if you had the black screen bug it will uh, also fix it. Uh, you'll first need to update your drivers. Go to, uh, it works for NVIDIA graphic cards, go to NVIDIA and check for updates. I already updated fully and it should be updated. Go to preferences and choose include beta updates. Take everything of these, it's the default. Now go to OK. Now you'll need to change some settings in your NVIDIA graphic card. Go to NVIDIA control panel, you can find it like this. And just it's first on the list, of course. Now you need to adjust image settings with the view. Uh, use balanced settings like this. Not all to enough performance that's balanced. Go to apply. <coughs> now manage 3D settings. Uh, you should click on global settings first and select high performance NVIDIA processor. It will will really much help to you and it makes your game run better and program settings uh, you can select uh, Hitman Absolution or HMA.x and just add it to your list and this will only this program will work like this or you can select uh, any other game if you want if it doesn't work it will help to all games you want now you can click apply and close this now you'll need MSI Afterburner it's really useful program for making your PC or lab, whatever you have, work faster. Go to MSI after dinner. Download the first button. It has many, you can see, but the first is better. Now download and just install. Or like, it's not hard. Just install it and uh, restart your computer. Then uh, go to MSI after banner. Wherever you want to play this game or any other game that you can't run or it crashes, freezes, it will also help you other games. It needs to run really long but you can wait. Now uh, here you need to make your core clock works at 9.50 uh, and memory clock works 9.50 and just go apply then start the game and uh, after that it will size your temperature on GPU and you will need to reset it after you play the game and close it just close and that's it if I show you how to fix the bug it will work on almost all graphic cards and thanks for watching